My name is Brian Siddle. Um, I work for NBCC in Moncton. In my regular day routine, I am the uh, uh, plumbing instructor, coordinator. We are in the shop probably 50% of the time and classroom is about 50% of the time as well. So we do the basics plumbing uh, starting off with uh, the pre-employment and then once they are completed with their block one, then usually they'll come back for the block two, three and four. I love my job uh, for many reasons. It's not necessarily cut out for everybody, but going through that transition with them, and even if they don't become a plumber, um, there are other avenues that they can take. And what's really, um, what really makes me feel good is knowing that I see the faces coming back for block two, block three and block four, and then finally they are on their way. And uh, they've accomplished something that took me a while to do as well. So it's, it's very uh, exciting to see them go through that role and, and come out on top in the end. Teaching different techniques with my students and, and throughout my, my career, um, just showing them small little things that actually mean an awful lot to them, something that I do on a regular basis when I was working hands-on before I became an instructor. Um, basically, it, it helps me wake up in the morning, know that I'm, I'm going to do something great for these students every day, I guess motivates me the best. When I was in high school, my original career that I thought I was going to start with was carpentry. Um, I didn't have, my marks weren't quite high enough for the carpentry spot. They actually were, but there was a lot in, in front of me. So my father actually told me to take plumbing. So when I started plumbing, I actually enjoyed it more so than what I thought. Um, and then I continued on to uh, get my uh, license, my IP license. I went out west for a while, came back to New Brunswick. I worked for a company for 24 years and we got to do a little bit of everything. It was nice because it was a smaller company. So we did rural water, uh, we did apartment buildings, we did uh, uh, your residential housing. And it was, it was a really good experience. And then I just got a question one day from my boss saying, you'd be a good instructor. And I said, why is that? Because all the apprentices that went through the company actually went through me. And that's when I decided that maybe I would change my career. And I'm, I'm just very fortunate that I had that opportunity. In, in any career that you want to take, if there's a possibility that when you're going through school, co-op is, is huge because it's going to give you that path to let you actually see that there's, there's pros and cons to everything. There's ups and downs. And then that way, that gives you that feeling on whether you actually want to, but not just other people that just think they want to be. At least they, they have that opportunity to actually be hands-on. Um, and that makes a big difference when they are coming in. We get an awful lot of students coming in that had that opportunity. They already know that that's the program they want to take. And that, that's, that is probably the best step, I'm going to say, that, that you could take. Whether you're taking plumbing, carpentry, electrical, I personally think that going through that program is huge. 